That's real funny, Jim. Send it blows a string. Football team being jealous of you. <laughs> what you think about getting in that science fair now? I don't think we got a chance. God bless her heart. Aunt Joanne hadn't seen you in about a year and a half. You look like a sausage. Well, he does not. Happy birthday, Homer. Mwah. It'll stretch some when you wear it. You be sure to send her a nice thank you note now. Hey, John. Uh, oh, happy birthday, Homer. And uh, got this in the mail. Must be a present from Grandma. Oh, it's an autographed picture. Grandma? Where they get socks? Warner Von Braun. Well, wonder how he knew it was your birthday. I don't reckon he did. Dear Homer, congratulations on your rocket building. Continue your education and maybe one day... Well, you better take an interest in your own damn town. Instead of wasting your time worrying about Werner Von Braun and uh, Cape Canaveral. John, it's his birthday. All right, Homer, I... He's got a lot on his mind. Yeah, well, I don't give a damn. Principles of guided missile design. I had Miss Waters order it for you a while back and it just came in. I know the math is too advanced for you. It is for me, too. There's calculus differential equations. No, I learned the math. This is great, Miss Riley. I learned everything. Best present anyone's ever given me. Thank you. I'm gonna show the guys. Quentin, I'll be okay. It's great. Where are you going? Just. Where'd you get this? I gave it to him. Miss Riley. Miss Riley, our job is to give these kids an education, mm -hmm. not false hopes. False hopes? Do you want me to sit quiet? Let them breathe in cold dust the rest of their life? Miss Riley. Once in a while, a lucky one will get out on a football scholarship. The rest of them work in the mines. How about I believe in the unlucky ones? Hmm? I have to, Mr. Turner. I'd go out of my mind. Well, thank you. It's my granddad's recipe. <laughs> oh, that's good. good. Hey, Homer. Happy birthday, son. Got some good news for you, Homer. Say hello to Fred Smith from the University of West Virginia. Hello, Homer. Sir, Mr. Smith wants Jim to play football there. He's offering him a full scholarship. Well, congratulations, Jim. 
Do you play ball, son? Uh, Homer shoots off rockets. You know, <laughs> all that. Well, rockets aren't exactly my field, son. Maybe if you work hard enough, you get to go to college, too. Yeah, on a science fiction scholarship, maybe. Jim. <laughs> Dear Dr. Von Braun, thank you for the autographed picture. It will only further inspire me to keep working toward our all-important goal of entering that science fair in the spring. off a rocket today. Thought you'd like to come see it. I gotta catch up on some work. How, how come, how come you never have work when Jim plays football? You never miss a game. <clears throat> what time are you gonna do it? About four o'clock. Uh, I can't promise you. Somebody pulled a pillar too close. Yeah. Well, thank God for that. Yeah, right now. Nobody hurt. Homer Hickam. I'm, Mason. I'm Basil Thorpe with the Bluefield Telegraph. Can I ask you a few questions? Sure. <laughs> the silvery cylinder burst forth in a fiery column of smoke and flame, racing the very wind as it soared into the sky. A messenger of these rocket boys of Big Creek. These boys use their brains, not brawn. <laughs> Who play not football. <laughs>